And those are two huge add-on runs for nothing Indians. Tigers got one back in the bottom of the ninth, and then left the bases loaded. Eric Cost made the final out again two days in a row. Yeah. And I thought that was with the home run also had the catch on Haas. Yes. Uh, the night before, mm -hmm. great catch. Yeah, uh, absolutely. It's, uh, the Tigers have lost four in a row. Four won the final, like we said. They go at it again tonight. Arena against stop sign. Turn right onto Woodward Avenue. Uh, Lions uh, begin OTAs. They've been you know, giving pretty good attendance from what we understand, as opposed to like Green Bay, where all the wide receivers didn't show up either. The they, 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 the quarterback. They, yeah, they, if they don't have a quarterback thrown into them, why would they be there? Yes. Uh, speaking of quarterbacks, uh, no word yet on Deshaun Watson and what's going to happen legally and with In his football. In 1.5 football. miles, turn right uh, onto Cesar East yeah, Chavez Avenue. As everybody knows, you know, what's out of Houston. And then the allegations, 22 of them came out. That, uh, he was uh, inappropriate with uh, some sexual stuff with uh, massage therapists. Now, the precedent is the NFL has that list where they put people on, right? So Commissioner they, exempt list. The exempt list. It's a basically paid leave until yeah. they can sort things out. And he hasn't been placed on it yet. Obviously, there's no games that are going to be played right now. And he's not even there for OTAs because he does want the trade. We touched on a little bit yesterday. I think it's ridiculous that he still is, is pursuing that because who would want to take on a player? Correct. Right now, that could be on the commissioner exempt list or locked up. Right. I mean, there's a lot of different ways this could go. But the question is, and you asked this, um, and, and I think I put it on my prep as well, do we think he should even play this year? Because they came out, I believe it was yesterday, that he's In not going to be the right until February of 22. So he's going to go throughout this entire season. And there's, it's going to seem like there's no progress being made on these cases. It's a hard question to answer because I'm not saying that he's innocent. I'm not saying he's guilty. We don't know. We, we don't. Okay, so if you have 22 allegations, you would assume, and I'm using the word assume, uh, that you're probably guilty of a couple. But you know, Stay in the right here's place. the other thing, too. Now, I know that there was a criminal case brought against him, but those 22 are all civil cases. Right. So, if it was only the civil cases, um, I believe that it would be very hard for Roger Goodell, who has a wide scope in sheriff. He is the sheriff, and he has, there's a, the language in the CBA, but again, this is this was the CBA, I think it's right. crazy, is so vague, and gives him basically the leeway to, to say, well, if you possibly violated the personal conduct policy, maybe you didn't do anything illegal, but if, if you brought shame to the league, then he can he can put him on that list for two games, eight games, the entire season. Correct. Uh, and so the, the question then becomes, what happens with a criminal case? Because there haven't been any indictments. There, I don't even, there haven't even been any formal charges, but there is a criminal investigation. And I, I believe, right or wrong, until there is a, a, a criminal charge filed or a criminal indictment, you know, levy, that they're probably going to let At this play Turn out. Right onto Baldwin Avenue. And unless they get massive public response, negative response, which is probably what Goodell is going to be looking at. If they get negative response, he's going to put them on that list. Probably. And if you're in Houston, Texas, obviously, in one mile, be able to show up to onto Merrimack Street. Yeah, you want him to you, show you, up. You want him to, you want him to play. Yeah, you want him to play. You want him to show up. I mean, because if he doesn't, and then everybody's talking about, you know, obviously, David Culley, first-year coach. Right. We all know what, what's going on with hiring the coach, hiring the GM, and the Deshaun Watson decision that, hey, I, w I didn't have enough say. They didn't listen to me. I want out, um, but you would love to still have him there because if he's not there, you're looking at probably the worst record in the NFL next season. Right. Here's the other thing. Our telephone number is 248 they were great last year. With right. Now, um, look, obviously the Lions, uh, they don't think they need a quarterback, so they wouldn't go after Deshaun Watson. Um, well, that's kind of interesting. If you're a team in the NFL, would you even go after him in a trade with, with Houston? I mean, I don't think you make a trade say, all right, we're going to trade, you know, we'll give you two number twos for Deshaun Watson. But if he can't play, if he goes to jail in a year, you have to give a certain I don't think you know. You can't be contingent right. on, you know, him, you know, if he goes to jail or if he can't play for you know, an extended amount of time. I don't think you can have that contingent.
happened was is that there was talk of a settlement the between you know, the left him and these 22 ladies. Left turn onto and West the Road. fact that then Deshaun Watson left. is the one that wants to make that settlement public. If you're turn looking at, okay, okay, well, if he's paying these ladies, and I'm just going to throw Maramax out Street. numbers, I have no idea, nobody's reported this at all. Right. If he's throwing out ten or $15,000 to these ladies, that will be seen as a nuisance fee and that there isn't much merit to the case. People will draw conclusions on how much he pays Correct. to these individuals. Right. If it's like 50, 100 thousands of dollars, and you say, hmm. Yeah, well, then you're like, well, mm, well let's see what, yes. you know, there might be something more. Go past this um, stop sign. But if he's then the one the that block, wants to make that public, left. normally the defendant is the one that wants to have all of that sealed. Right. So that's, I mean, that just adds another wrinkle that if he's the one that if they have negotiated a settlement, and Deshaun Watson is the one and his and attorney that, that is pushing for it to be made public. Well, I, I, I mean, again, you is this you think he's is, is this a great play by Rusty Harden or is you know I mean what is going on? There's just so many ways that you can look at this, um, and and I think until there is something Turn left that South is Maramax criminal, Street. then the destination is on Deshaun your Deshaun right. Watson will most likely be playing this year. And I, I agree with that, and I, I think if he, if they don't believe, like if he's, if he truly believes he's innocent, didn't do anything wrong, and he's going to get off out of this, then they need to play it out. Right. They, 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 they do. But if, if they don't believe that, the if he knows he did right. wrong, he's got to settle. South, it's the perfect Street. year to settle for him. Get it Arrived. out of the way. Get the punishment out of the way, and then you put yourself back out there, and maybe 